The question is whether copper 2 chloride, that CuCl2, is soluble or insoluble in water. And the short answer is that it's soluble in water. There are three ways we can figure that out. First, we can have memorized the solubility rules here. So as we go down our rules, we see that compounds that have that chloride ion, bromide and iodide, they're soluble with a few exceptions. Copper is not one of the exceptions. So we have this chlorine here. This is going to be a soluble compound. We can also look at a solubility chart. So here's a solubility chart. The positive ions are on the left, and on the top we have the anions, the negative ions. So let's find copper 2 right here, Cu2+, and then the chloride, Cl-. minus. We go over and down, and that S right there, that means that it's going to be soluble in water. When you put it in water, it'll dissolve, dissociate, or just break apart into its ions we'll have the copper 2 plus ion, and then we'll have two of the chloride ions, the Cl minus ions, and they'll be dissolved in water. They'll be aqueous and put a little AQ after them. The reason that we know this is copper 2 is because each one of these chlorines is negative, and we have two of them, so this has to be 2 plus for it to balance out. So that's our copper 2 chloride, which is soluble in water. One final way we could check this, we could just get some crystals of copper 2 chloride, put it in water and see what happened. Based on our solubility chart and on the rules that we saw, it should dissolve in water. This is Dr. B answering the question whether copper 2 chloride is soluble in water. It is soluble. Thanks for watching.